Black Adam vs. Shazam – Who is Stronger? The 11th film in the DCEU, titled Black Adam, is scheduled to be released in theaters all around the world. The film is directed by Jaume Colette Serra, and Dwayne Johnson plays the eponymous character. The story of the movie will focus on Black Adam's release from captivity after 5,000 years, at which point he would vent his vengeance on the city of Kandak. The Justice Society of the United States gets aware of his savagery and makes an effort to stop him, while also attempting to persuade him to become a hero rather than a monster. Now, a question that often leaves fans scratching their heads is, who is more powerful, Black Adam or Shazam? So keep watching because the riddle will be solved in this video. Powers of Shazam and Black Adam Despite the fact that Black Adam and Shazam both possess an endless number of skills and talents, one of them is far more powerful than the other. The abilities that Shazam has are derived from the letters of his own name. Because Solomon can readily access such a vast store of scientific information, the letter S represents the wisdom that Solomon has. Hercules has superhuman strength, which places him among the most powerful characters in DC Comics and earns him the moniker H, which stands for the might of Hercules. The letter A refers to Atlas's extraordinary endurance, which enables him to recover from any physical injury in a matter of minutes and prevents him from ever feeling exhausted. Additionally, any bodily wounds he sustains are instantly healed. The letter Z represents the strength of Zeus, which allows him to withstand the magical spells and assaults that are sent against him. The magical lightning is also powered by Zeus. The letter A in his name represents the courage of Achilles, which indicates that he has a tremendous amount of inner strength, courage, and resolve. Shazam is able to move as rapidly as a bolt of lightning and fly at speeds greater than the speed of sound since the last letter in his name stands for the speed of Mercury simply uttering the word Shazam. On the other hand, Black Adam is able to take control of the Teth body. Because he has the stamina of Shu, he is able to resist very high levels of physical pressure without succumbing to injury. He also has the swiftness of Hero, which enables him to move and soar at speeds that are beyond those of a normal person. Furthermore, Adam inherits the superhuman strength of Amon, which enables him to break steel, smash through walls, and lift enormous items. The force of Aton is what feeds the magical thunderbolt that changes Adam, while the knowledge of Zahuti offers him guidance and assistance when he is in a difficult situation. Together, these two things help him. Also, the bravery of Mahen is a psychological power that provides Adam with huge quantities of inner strength to draw from and almost invulnerability. Who would win, Black Adam or Shazam? It is clear to observe that both Shazam and Black Adam possess the same abilities. The origin of Black Adam's abilities used to be entirely different, but in later incarnations of the character, even this facet of their personalities has remained the same. One would reasonably conclude from this fact that the two of them are equivalent and that there is no clear victor. Nevertheless, there is a caveat to this assumption. To be more specific, Black Adam has been in possession of his abilities for an untold number of years. Shazam is a rather recent addition to the scene overall. During that time, Black Adam had considerably more time to study all his abilities provided to him. And since the source is nearly limitless, Black Adam surely had time to learn some of the things that Shazam has not yet discovered. This is undoubtedly what makes Black Adam such a dangerous threat. Just keep in mind that when the three of them battled, it took a united effort from both Superman and Shazam to beat Black Adam, since Black Adam was manhandling each of them separately. The fact that Black Adam is ready to murder is another quality that sets him apart from Shazam. Black Adam is much more dangerous than Shazam, who is, after all, a superhero, since he has almost no inhibitions and can do anything he wants. His fury is scary, and he has shown that he is capable of putting an end to someone's life with only one stroke. In this regard, he is a great deal more perilous than Shazam, and despite the fact that he almost always comes out on the losing end, since the good guys have to rescue the day, we feel that objectively speaking, Black Adam is still a good deal more powerful than Shazam. Could Black Adam be considered a more dangerous opponent than Shazam? We all knew that there is no way that Superman can be beaten without utilizing the story device, which is the kryptonite and that has probably been overdone in both movies and comics at this point. 
On the other hand, the circumstances surrounding Black Adam and Shazam are not quite the same as those that existed while Superman was battling Batman. When Shazam goes up against Black Adam, though, we won't have to worry about that happening. Neither of them has any glaring weaknesses, such as an obstacle that is simple to overcome and might put an end to the fight right then and there. But it's very important to be known that the wizard Shazam is the one who endowed Black Adam and Billy Batson with their respective talents. However, there is a significant difference between where Black Adam gets his talents and where Shazam obtains his powers, and that difference is the Greek gods. As a quick refresher, when Billy Batson transforms into his superhero avatar, he is granted godlike powers such as the Wisdom of Solomon, the Strength of Hercules, the Stamina of Atlas, the Influence of Zeus, the Courage of Achilles, and the Speed of Mercury. Billy Batson was blessed with these godlike abilities by the gods who also bestowed them upon him. As a result, we may classify him as a superhero since he has an extraordinary variety of powers. But in the case of Black Adam, things are quite different. Who exactly is Black Adam? A villain or a hero? The character of Shazam is very similar to Superman in the sense that he not only possesses superpowers such as super strength, invulnerability, and flight, but he also acquires a wide variety of magical abilities. Even though the movie Shazam did not reveal all of his abilities, the character of Shazam is very similar to Superman in this regard. These magical skills include the capacity to conjure lightning, as well as the capability of rapidly and easily solving tough riddles and codes in the blink of an eye. It is quite difficult to put a halt to him since he is a one-man army. And one might say the exact same thing about Black Adam just substitute any enigmatic Egyptian deities for those gods that originated in ancient Greece. The history of how Black Adam came to have his own pantheon of gods is an intriguing piece of information to learn about. Since Black Adam lived some 5,000 years ago, there was no such thing as the Greek civilization as we know it in the year 3000 BC. As a direct outcome of the prior premise, you might argue that these Greek gods appeared far later in history than Black Adam did. Nevertheless, in spite of this, both Black Adam and Shazam are vulnerable to a single critical defect, which is most likely the only one they share. And that is that if they say the word Shazam, they are instantly forced to shift back into their human form. This is because the word Shazam forces them to do so. And after they have reverted to their human form, if one is able to keep them from using the word Shazam, then they are nothing more than normal humans who do not possess any of the superpowers or abilities they previously had. Leave a comment below telling us who you believe would win between Black Adam and Shazam and why you think they would win. Thanks for watching this video. Click the subscribe button and see you in the next video.